Hey folks, Bill Cook here. Let's get right to it. It's time for What's Cooking with Bill Cook. Okay, I won't lie to you guys. This month, the mystery team threw me for a loop. I have no idea what flight of fancy means. <laughs> I had to go look up in the dictionary what flight of fancy means. And long story short, to me, flight of fancy means a pipe dream. Okay, now we're talking language I understand. A pipe dream is something that every magician does, whether you know it or not. A pipe dream is basically to dream the impossible and to achieve the unattainable. So what do we as magicians constantly do that is considered a flight of fancy? What do you do that is impossible? What do you do that is considered unattainable? Reflect on that for a moment. But let's talk for a second about other people's expectations for us as magicians. I get asked constantly, frankly, crass, blatantly silly requests slash questions from spectators and helpers. Like, can you make my wife disappear? Can you make the check disappear? Can you turn my money into bigger money? See, if we could really do magic, we would do this all the time. But I also often get asked, so what's your real job? Or what else do you do when you're not playing magic? They don't always ask it in a negative way or in a nasty way, although it has been known to happen from time to time. But people look at being a magician as a flight of fancy, as a pipe dream. They don't understand. I had an ex-girlfriend tell me once as we were parting ways that my magic and my goal of being a professional magician is nothing more than a pipe dream and I will never achieve anything with it and I'll never go anywhere with my life. She definitely thought that this magic thing was nothing more than a pipe dream and a flight of fancy. But the cool thing is I am proof that magic as a profession isn't a flight of fancy. Now, don't get me wrong, this isn't easy. I've had to work more than half my life to do what I do and get to where I am, but it's not a pipe dream, ladies and gentlemen. It can happen, and you can do it too, if you're willing to put in the work. And I'm thrilled that we get to share in this amazing journey together. I'm going to leave you guys with a quote from Steve Maraboli. People who lack the clarity, courage, and determination to follow their own dreams will often find ways to discourage yours. Live your truth and don't ever stop. Folks, this has been What's Cooking with Bill Cook. Keep following those flights of fancy wherever they may take you, and I'll catch you next time. Take care. Bye.